Yo, what is up, boys and girls? We are back with WWE Shut Your Mouth, and this is episode 21. Now, the reason why I'm speaking kind of, it, it might not sound too low to y'all because, you know, I'm like right here next to my mic, but I'm speaking a little bit low because, like, what, three o'clock in the morning? I'm not trying to be loud waking up people at my house. So, with that being said, let's get right into it, boys. Welcome to SmackDown. I'm Jim Ross. Ooh. Jeff is still injured from last week. Oh yeah, that's right because um, if I can remember, Chris Jericho like slumped my ass on the floor. So people got just people just love punching me in the face, don't they? I don't think he can wrestle. Oh, so wait, hold on. Oh, oh wait, hold on. We got options. What is he gonna say? Uh, Jericho, you made a big mistake. I'll tell you the truth. That is me. Hmm. Should we start a little rivalry? Right, I can't even say that right, but should we start a little beef with uh Chris? I'll tell you the truth. I mean, obviously, it's me. Let's bring it. He punched us in the face. Let's bring his ass out. Yeah, bring his ass out. Let's call his ass out. He wanted to punch me and slump me because he won his title back because he was he was the um champion at one point, you know, the undisputed champion. So I can understand that. And here he come coming up with the best interest in the game, I might add. One of the best interests in the game, I should say. Now, I'm, I'm not gonna say the best, but I love his. Look at this. No, no, we already seen this, but wait, whoa, 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 he has a belt. Wait, what belt is this? Oh, he's the Intercontinental Champion. Oh, I just see, I didn't know that. Ever since I had to restart everything, like everything is kind of like, kind of different. You know, not by too much, but that's interesting. So he he has a belt, and I have two belts. Because remember, I'm the European champion, and I barely defended that belt, like barely. This game looks good for like this game came out in 2002, but this still looks pretty good. Like I might want to front either that or just my. My PC, I don't, I, I don't know. It just, it just looks sexy. Okay, here we go. We face to face with Y2J. He wants his belt back. I met someone who really needs me. Am I about to get jumped? I want to introduce this man. Oh, I can't believe it. That's Ric Flair. I can't believe this is happening. I always have respect for people who want to be the best. For example, Chris Jericho. I wanted to give him all of my support. I will I will allow at the next pay-per-view a one-on-one oh -on -one title match between Jericho and Jeff. Also, tonight we will have a little pre-match warm-up for that match. Enjoy. I like how he got his ring on, his uh, little Hall of Famer ring. That's that's, that's a cool, that's a nice little touch. All right, so we're going to go against one-on-one -on -one with Chris Jericho. Whoa, but that a regular one-on-one. -on -one. We teaming up with Hollywood Hulk Hogan, you know, our, our boy, against The Rock and Jericho. Two people we got beef with. Ooh, you know, I've been, I've been actually waiting for this because the remember The Rock's later. He like after we beat the NWO, then he gonna slump my ass out of that. So I'm actually, yeah, I'm expecting this. Let's go. Let's beat. Let's beat his booty. Look who we got here, the king of the mother effing dropkick, Maven. Bro, I was watching like one clip and Maven, uh, he busts Snitsky and Snitsky hit the holy jack of Oh, here we go. Hey, how are you doing? But she didn't stay in the WWE that long. I think he stayed for like, what, two, three years? Like, Maven did not stay long. Like, I've been, I've been seeing some matches. I'm like, damn, he went against that person? But, okay, uh, what is it? Why are you looking at my face like that? Uh, you look great. Yeah, what? Oh, yes, yeah, because of my training, I'm in great shape. He does got some thick ass eyebrows. God, jeez. If you like, I can give you some pointers. Uh, yeah, yeah, let's train together. Cool, let's go. Yeah, yeah, why not? Because we are a face. There's no point in, you know, being, you know. Do we, are we, I knew I was about to get thrown in a useless match. God, jeez, man. Oh, nice reversal by me. It's been a while since I last played, too. Like, that last video I uploaded was from a whole month ago. So, uh, you know what? Should I play this match? Should I, should I, I mean, not play it, but should I show y'all guys this match? Why not? We're we going to play it all the way through. Give me that snap suplex. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm I'm play it all the way through because why not right why not who who knows how long this episode is gonna be because I've been trying to cut back On uh, having episodes so long. So uh, hopefully he doesn't bitch. Oh my 
God, come on with the clothesline. Hold on, give me that arm drag. Okay, wait, hold on. But I tell you, I didn't I say something about he has the look at that. That is the most like he didn't hit me, he didn't connect with it. But that drop kick is beautiful. <laughs> he has the bet like Dolph Ziggler, watch out now. I wonder what Maven is doing nowadays. Hold on, what's oh no, he's a get off me girl. You're not hitting me get off of me girl. Here we go, clobbering. Give me that nuts. All right, let's uh let's do what I was originally supposed to do, which was the no, never mind. He's facing the other way. All right, just put him on the top rope. The tree well. Oh, stuff in the mud hole. All right, hold on. Give, give me them again. One more time. Ugh. What? Why did King just randomly say Maven like that? He just said Maven and didn't say anything else. Oh, oh, chill with the spinning wheel kicky. I don't even know what you call that. Mo oh, oh, call me Chris Benoit. Should I say that name? I, I don't think I should. But uh, yeah, nice, nice flying head, but Maven. All right, hold on. Hit him with the. Come on. Okay, you, you kind of giving me some hit him with the backdrop. <laughs> so they're right in sync with uh, Jr. Too. Hold on. Taking G. Right, hold on. See, I, I lo I kind of forgot how to play. I not, well, I didn't forget how to play play, but you know, I'm still, I'm still rusty. It's, it's, it's been a while. I swear to God, I say that every. I'm sorry if I say that like all the time, but it's true. Whisper. Ugh. And let's finish it. We're gonna finish it right here. Wait, go on top and uh. It's Chuan. Come on. And that's it. it what, what type of tattoo is that on the on the back of his shoulder? It looks, it looks gross. It's not even shaded. That's how you win, boys. How do you uh? This is how you celebrate, right? I know um, X and Square is how you attack him after the match, which we're not even gonna do because, like I said, we're a face. We don't. Never mind. All right, let's just go to the main event. <laughs> All right. So, oh, see, I be so <laughs> they they go all up and they're getting trash like usual. Oh, the eye rake by Chris Jericho, the best, one of the best wrestlers on the planet. I'm, I'm saying it right now, man. I know I talked about him last video, but like seriously, Chris Jericho was one of the best. Like if you go and look at his early matches alone, and I'm not talking about like his Canada stuff, cause I ain't watched them. I'm talking about like his early East, look at uh, Hawkster, what are you doing, man? You beating me up and then you hit, uh, come on. Hold on, I might as well, shoot, I might as well get in there too. All right. Hawkster handle him, but yeah, yo, his early East like he hasn't had one bad match in ECW. That's how good this guy is. And then he, obviously he went to WCW, then WWE. So yeah, man, like, like if you're into wrestling, like just watch his ECW matches. Like watch him versus Two Cold Scorpio, and they fought a lot of times. Two Cold, Two Cold Scorpio is one of the most underrated high flyers ever. Like dude is like he was doing stuff that nobody was doing back then nobody but anyway back to our match here we go we got hulk hogan versus Chris. oh oh snap mare into the drop kick into the lower back and then punches him in his do-rag i mean kicks him in the do-rag oh my god nasty drop kick the cocky cocky y2j but now hulk hogan's getting back on the offense with the headlock classic slowing up the pace Irish whip, no, he says no, and I, oh, nice little backdrop thing. I don't even know what you call that move, and here we go, Hawk is tagging us, and now, here we go, grab him, no, 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 oh, do not let him get his partner, nice leg sweep, and then here I come with the flop, oh, no, Chris, chill, I know, we, I know you want this belt, oh, flapjack, oh, no, nah, and then he about to tag, no, yeah, tagging the rock, I actually want my, oh, my God, can you, uh, Hawkster, can you get in there? How do you call him in? There we go. Yeah, get in here because then it was like 2 one one and I don't appreciate that backbreaker. Okay, there we go. Uh, how do you switch again? Oh, no, no, no. Oh, I'm sorry. Pile driver. Spike them. Yeah, I want you. Oh my God, no. No. Rock bottom. Oh my God, get in this ring. Get in this ring. Oh yes, we had the rope break. Thank you. I don't think I took enough damage to even get pinned, but I don't want to risk anything, right? Oh my god, the rock is on my ass right now. Bro, chill. Matter of fact, I'm the one that should be on your ass because you're the one that betrayed me. I guess he. Now we ironically be teaming up with, uh, you know, the person that we was, you know, trying to beat, which is, uh, the hoaxer, which is, uh, Earl Hebner, give me a chance. Damn, I didn't even get a chance to even get out the ring. Chill. And then we tap the hoaxer back in. Hold on. Yeah, let's go for the double team. Yeah, come on. Right back in. You're tripping. 
You tripping? All right, handle that Hawkster. By the way, they had a yo a, another match I can recommend to you guys: Hulk Hogan versus The Rock at WrestleMania. I, I forgot which one, but bruh, yo, it's not even about the match. It's just about the the storytelling. Like, oh my god, man, storytelling goes so far in wrestling matches. And the one thing I hate about um wrestling nowadays is the spots like spots are like everywhere especially in like aew oh man just you know like wrestling is more than just like spots there's like you flying out the ring waiting for the guy to catch you like come on man you're just making a sport look even more fake with all them damn spots but anyway i digress back to the match right now we have Chris Jericho on the offense and probably not a smart idea to be pitting hold on no punch him no no I'm getting in there effort lion salt thank god I came in the ring get that break that up boy break that up y'all what you thought this was oh come on okay there we go Hulk oh you pointed to him classic Ugh. clothesline yes baby Oh my god, what a good finish. Hold on, how do you switch? How do you there we go? Okay, it's R2. And that's how you win. That is exactly how we won last time. So now we are two and zero in tag team competition with the hoaxer. I love it, man. That was gonna happen because I know something is gonna happen. We're gonna get jumped after the match by these two sore losers. I know that's what's gonna happen. Oh, Rick Flair. Oh, yep, here we go. Horton for Jericho to be eliminated to the outside of the ring. <laughs> there they are victorious in the ring yeah you sore fucking loser don't punch him. oh wait 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 oh no 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 we call him back in like how we did in uh wrestlemania he's asking jeff to do what we gotta hawk out again right wait what who's about to happen are we about to ask him to hawk out or what I got it. Yep, yep, we doing it again. <laughs> I like this little tag team. He's the original. Look at that. Oh yeah, he's actually they actually playing the OG song. Okay, they they wasn't doing that before. And it hurts inside. I'll stop. Jeff and Hart. Jeff and Hogan are both extraordinary athletes. Yes, we are. Everyone is showing respect for them. Oh, yes. Thumbnail. Yes. Look at that. <laughs> Y'all like that. Oh, yeah. That's thumbnail material right there. Oh, my God. Fight for the rights of every man. I'll stop. Now we are at Backlash. About to go against Chris Jericho for our undisputed title. Let's get it. Oh man, we're back at Backlash. Remember this, y'all? Remember how I was saying this is my favorite stage? Funny enough, when we last was here, it was a, I, I'm pretty sure it was a year ago when we were last here. And now look, it's a, it's a year again. By the way, it's a new year. Happy New Year's to everybody. Hopefully you're having a beautiful day, beautiful morning, beautiful night, whatever time it is for you. Uh, be safe out there. And you know, with that being said, let's continue on with the video. All right, my mouth was a little dry, but we back into the business. So right now we have Scotty Too Hotty, to Jerry, Chuck, and Matt Hardy in a fatal four-way TLC match. And I think this is for the hardcore title, I think. I'm not sure. Uh, and Chuck wins. Oh, Lord. So we have Chuck win that, uh, a.k.a. Chuck Colombo or Palumbo, whatever. Then we have The Rock versus Kane. Yo, Kane. Be please, Kane win. Please? Oh, come on, Kane. All right, then we have our match for the Undisputed Championship. Let's get it, man. Hopefully, Chris can, you know, show us what's... He might wind up winning. Who knows? Let, I'm, let me not jinx it. Let's get... Rock run... Oh, okay. So, Rock... Okay, so that was the first Contenders match. Ooh... Okay, I'm kind of happy that Kane didn't win now because now we get to face The Rock if we do wind up winning. So, uh, let's get it. Because, like, you know, Kane is still my buddy. You know, I don't want to fight Kane, you know, even though we... What? A running? Are you joking right now? Like, but the match just started. Rock, can you not referee? Get The Rock, please. Wait, is he helping me? 
I don't get it. I'm confused. Hold on, he's gonna come after me. Wait, he's helping me. Does he want me to win? He must want me. I am confused. Wait, I thought he was coming after me. Hey, look at this, JR. I am so lost right now. Am I like at a loss for word now? Yes. Wow. The people's elbow. Uh, uh, uh. The most dramatic finishing move in all of sports entertainment. Oh my, is that how I'm a, is that how I'm a win? No, it's not, but that was damn near close. Wow. What is going on? I think, I think The Rock wants me to win because I think I'm his target. He, I mean, he did punch me. You know, so he got some type of we, we still have a beef from all those episodes ago. So I mean, I guess he just want to have me to himself. He don't want Chris Jericho. He wants Jeff Hardy. So, I mean, if that's if that's the case, then it makes sense. But otherwise, I mean, I'm just confused. But I think I think that's it, though. If not, then that's going to be the lore. If they don't explain it, that is uh, neck breaker, neck breaker, like slam. Punch them in the head. Let's go. You know what I just noticed? This game has no bleeding effects. I think they, they start they start doing uh, bust open stuff like in the next game, Frankensteiner, and we are close to having our finisher too. So uh, we're about to be close to. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not just no, no no no. I was about to say I'm about to just twist the fade him, but no, we got to end it with a swanton. Look at him flat out. They didn't even put. Up, I mean, I would say he didn't put up a challenge. Okay. I was gonna say he didn't put up a challenge, but we did just jump his ass away. Wow, and that's how we defend the belt. <laughs> wow. I mean, I'm not mad. Hey, Rock, do what you. Hey, I, 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 I didn't force you to help me. I mean, hey, that, if you want to help me like that, hey, go ahead. And look at that. We retained successfully because of the Rock, but still. Damn. So I'm, I'm wondering what's gonna happen next week. Like, is he gonna be? Whoa. Wait, something might happen. Hold on, guys. Wait, something might. No, no, no. Oh, I get to pick a. Let's go with a Christian attire because I like Christian. So is anything gonna happen or no? I guess nothing. Wow. I wonder what's gonna happen next week. I'm actually going to end the video right here. Hopefully you guys are having a is May 1st. Hopefully you guys are having a beautiful day, beautiful night. Make sure you do your boy a favor and like, subscribe, and share. Obviously, it's not necessary. Just you watching the video is enough. But if you want to continue to keep watching me, then you gotta subscribe, right? To know when I upload. So with that being said, I'm done. Um, I'm getting off. I'm about to take my ass to bed. I'll edit this later. And with that being said, remember, guys, to always stay sweet.